feels like we just got done with Rio. Doesn't it? Uh, we have a year to go, but we are already getting excited for the 2018 Winter Olympics in Pyeongchang, South Korea. 365 days until the competition starts, and Kimberly Gill is back with the athletes to watch that, you know, they have ties to Metro Detroit, and we're really starting to build relationships yeah. with some yes. of them. Yes, and we're getting excited, too. It's never too early to get excited, no. right? Even though, what, well, we got 364 days, 6 hours, and 16 minutes. We have Olympic hopefuls in speed skating, snowboarding, and figure skating. Take a look. Another quad, quad toe. At 17, Nathan Chen is already making history. The first figure skater to ever land five quadruple jumps in a single program. Last month, he won his first national championship and will compete in the world championships in March, but he's already eyeing the 2018 Winter Games. That's the biggest motivator for me, just as, a, as an athlete, you know, to to go to the Olympics and you know stand on top of that podium, it's something that I feel like most every single athlete dreams about. Nathan trains in California and here in Michigan alongside ice dancers Maya and Alex Shibutani at the Arctic edge of Canton. Known as the Shib Sibs, this brother and sister duo from Ann Arbor just won back-to-back -back national championships. The games in South Korea will be their second. Just the fact that we're one year out, we've been training for our second Olympic Games for so long, and so we're feeling really ready to go. Yeah, we're, we're definitely where we want to be as far as our preparations go, and the way that we've progressed since 2014, we feel really good about where we're headed. <laughs> Close competitors are Madison Chalk and Evan Bates, who train at the Novi Ice Arena. There's definitely a healthy competition. I think they push us to be better and work harder. Evan is from Ann Arbor. They're the 2015 national champions and also competed in Sochi. Well, we've said we wanted to be on the podium. Uh, we've said that in the years past, and that hasn't changed. You know, based on our results at the World Championships, we've been on the podium the last two seasons, so I think it's a realistic goal. And the third American ice dance team to watch is Madison Hubble and Zachary Donahue. Madison Hubble is from the Lansing area, and a big announcement from Gracie Gold just today. I've just started training in Canton, Michigan. That's right. Gracie will prepare in Canton for the next Olympic Games. I love you. Carly Shore is one of the Metro Detroiters hoping to get big air in South Korea as part of the U.S. snowboarding team. The Milford native got her start in Boeing, placed sixth in Sochi, and now she travels the world to compete. Everybody wants that Olympic medal. It's like, of course I'm going to dream for that, but I'm just going to do my best. Snowboarders Kyle Mack of West Bloomfield, Danny Davis of Highland, and Eric Boschman of Grand Blanc are aiming to be on Team USA for the games as well. Speed skaters Jessica Corman of Melvindale and Kelly Gunther of Clinton Township are hopefuls for the Winter Games. Both competed in Sochi in 2014. And uh, no decisions yet from Merrill Davis and Charlie White about whether they will compete in another Olympics. At the 2014 Games, though, they became, became the first American ice dance team to win an Olympic gold medal, and they won silver in 2010. So we will wait to hear from them. They're playing hard to get. <laughs> you know you want to be there, Of Marilyn course you Charlie. do. We, of yeah, course we you need do. you there. Yeah. Now, the interesting thing is we have become this hub for a, a lot of these ice dance teams, but not just American teams. Yeah, too. yeah, you're absolutely right. And I think it has to do with all the great facilities that we have mm -hmm. here. We have the Novi Ice Arena. We have the Arctic Edge in Canton. Yeah. We have uh, the other uh, Detroit Skating Club in West Bloomfield. Mm -hmm. And at any time, I mean, I think right now we have about 22 dancers mm -hmm. in our area that are preparing. So that's, you know, really That's the world capital of it. That's yeah, really awesome. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Cool. We'll be cheering them on. And as you said, they come from all over the world. Can you imagine just being a little kid having your practice before they all start coming oh, on? It, it's Great oh, for the kids no to doubt. see that too. That would be contagious. Yeah. Really cool. So Thanks, you're Kim. away. You ready yep. for that? Get your skates on, Bernie. <laughs> I'm already looking Bernie, for a Korean restaurant. <laughs> Good idea. Right. Exactly Food right.